layups are pretty they're pretty incredible you have the whole team and we're all set and ready to go because you only have a certain amount of time before the epoxy sets so everyone has to be working together we all have to know the plan and then we have to execute that plan we never actually know how the layup's going to turn out until 24 hours after we've vacuum bed everything so that waiting period is typically uh it's pretty anxious because you don't know if things went the way you wanted them to. Especially when we made Orion, we utilized molds so that we had a hollow aircraft and just taking the carbon fiber off those molds and seeing that final product, seeing that sheen and just that finish on the carbon fiber, was it was amazing. That was really cool. My name is Alison Rozefka. I'm a junior studying materials science and engineering and minoring in fiber science here at Cornell University. The materials that we use on Orion um, are industry grade and they're also very expensive. Um, carbon fiber especially has a very high strength to weight ratio. Um, so utilizing that material allows us to actually increase our wingspan by about 25%. Um, that translates to a more stable flight and allows our vision team to get better pictures um, and overall helps us do better at competition. Working with composite materials, you learn a lot of different skills because it's really three different materials working as a system together. Um, so in that part, you have to know how to lay up a single sheet, you have to lay up with foam, and then you also have to know how to lay up together. In the future, we're starting to look into honeycomb and flex form materials, which is very expensive. You actually have to go out and talk to companies to get a quote. It's not always available commercially. Everything we do on Seaware is a team effort and we're going to need financial support to take on our next challenge, which is the Unmanned Airborne Vehicle Competition in Australia. Obtaining the resources necessary to reduce weight in our system is going to be crucial to achieving our goals.